In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to expand a TrueCrypt volume with some other tools. So to start with, we're going to need a copy of some other external third-party tools to work with TrueCrypt. And this one is called the EXTCV. And we, have, we want version 07, which works with TrueCrypt uh, 7.1a. And I believe the previous version to this uh, worked with uh, TrueCrypt 7.0. We're going to download this file. I'm just going to grab that, save. I'm going to save it on my drive H here. Just like that, we have the file. Okay, so the next thing now is on our drive, we have our file here which we need to extract. So I'm just going to extract all. And that extracts it into this uh, particular folder here. So this is the file that we will need. But before we get there, I'm going to look inside of our SSS demo portable apps, which is from Big Byte Technologies. This is the zip file I downloaded, and once it's extracted, we have our file in here. And inside our volume right now, you'll see here's our portable apps, and it's at just over 100 megs. So we're going to need to be expanding that particular TrueCrypt volume. So we're going to use our tools here to do this. So let's get started with that. So I'm going to go into the folder and double click on it just to run it. I'm going to say always ask before opening this file. I'm going to shut that off. And click on run. So the next thing now we need is to select the file for it. So if I click on it to select the file, back up on our drive H into our portables, inside to our volumes and our portables.tc volume. Okay, so we got that in there. The next thing we have to do is hit start. The volume does not contain any hi another hidden volume. The password for the volume is portables. All lowercase, so if you see that there. Okay. And we're going to make this into a 1 gig volume. So I'm just going to choose 1. And we've got it marked as gigabytes. So we're going to just hit continue. Now we need to move this around to make the security a little more random on here. All right, so now I'm just going to hit continue. Now, my understanding of this particular uh, program, it requires an NTFS partition. And in this case, this is what we have. Inside of our portables.tc file, it's a NTFS partition. So we can use that successfully to expand here. OK, that's all we have to do. And go exit. And so I believe that if it's a uh, FAT32 file that it just won't work. Alright, so now let's go look inside of our folder again. Inside our volumes. And now we can see we have a 1 gig file. And just to, uh, to run this as our demo, put in our password of portables. Alright. And here we have it. Now we can see that there's lots of room on the, on the, uh, the demo one. So don't forget to check out some of these things on Big Bike Technologies website, and I hope you enjoyed this, and it's been helpful. Thank you.